I'm Roxanne, the Rustboro Pokemon Gym Leader. I became a gym leader so that I may apply what I learned at the Pokemon Trainer School in battle. Would you kindly demonstrate how you battle, and with which Pokemon? I'm Brawly, Doofit's Gym Leader. I've been churned in the rough waves of these parts, and I've grown tough in the pitch black cave. So you wanted to challenge me. Let me see what you're made of. I've given up my plans to convert the city I have. And so, I put my time into making door traps in my gym. Oh? Now what are you doing here? What's that? You say you've gotten past all my rigged doors? Wahaha! Now that is amusing! Then I, Watson, the leader of Malville Gym, shall electrify you! Welcome! No, wait! Puny trainer! How good to see you made it here! I have been entrusted with the... No, wait! I, I am Flannery, and I'm the gym leader here. Uh, dare not underestimate me, though I have been leader only a short time. With skills inherited from my grandfather, I shall, uh, demonstrate the hot moves we have honed on this land. Mm, so, you take a four badges. Fine, as promised. We will have a Pokemon battle, Brendan. I'm so happy that I can have a real battle with my own child, but... Battle is a battle. I will do everything in my power as a gym leader to win. Brendan, you had better give her your best shot too. I am Winona. I am the leader of the Four Tree Pokemon Gym. I have become one with bird Pokemon and have soared the skies. However grueling the battle, we have triumphed with grace. Witness the elegant choreography of bird Pokemon and I. <laughs> Were you surprised? <laughs> <laughs> Were you surprised that, that there are two gym leaders? We're, We're twins. twins! We don't need to talk, because we can each determine what the other is thinking. All in our minds! This combination of ours... Can you beat it? Allow me to formally introduce myself. I'm Waltz, the gym leader of Cetopolis. There's something about you, a difference in your demeanor. I think I sense that in you. What happened inside the Cave of Origin, and what you did, and we'll likely learn through our upcoming battle. Now show me, show me the power you wield with your Pokémon! And I, in turn, shall present you with a performance of Illusions and Water by me and my Pokémon! Let me ask you, did you know? Huh, I should not be so coy. It was I who taught Wallace everything there is to know about Pokémon. Once, I had given up my position as the gym leader. My place? I had entrusted Wallace with the gym, however, a compelling reason arose me to make a comeback. Ah, uh, but enough chatter. Let us begin our match, shall we? Please, you shall bear witness to our artistry, a grand illusion of water sculpted by Pokemon and myself. Class is now in session. So, I lost. Seems I still have much more to learn. I understand. The Pokemon League's rules state that trainers are to be given this if they defeat a gym leader. Please, accept the official Pokemon League stone badge. Let's ride this wave! Whoa! Wow! You made a much bigger splash than I expected. You swamped me. Okay, you've got me. Take this gym badge. Let's get her done! <laughs> Fine, I lost! You ended up giving me a thrill! Take this badge! Alright! Let's do this! Oh, uh, I guess I was trying too hard. I I've only recently become a gym leader. I tried too hard to be someone I'm not. I have to do things my natural way. If I don't, my Pokémon will be confused. Thanks for teaching me that. For that, you deserve this. I won't hold back just because you're my son! I... I can't... can't believe it! Brendan! I lost to Brendan! But... rules are rules! Here, take this! Let's get this battle off the ground! Never before have I seen a trainer command Pokémon with more grace than I! In recognition of your prowess, I present to you this gym badge! Let's win this, Tate! You got it, Liza! Behold our, our psychic, psychic power. power! What? Our combination was shattered! It can't be helped. You've won. So, in recognition, 
Take this! I welcome you to my stage! Bravo! I realize now your authenticity and magnificence is the Pokemon trainer! I find much joy in having met you and your Pokemon! You have proven yourself worthy of the Rain Badge! Accept it! Show me this determination of yours! <laughs> Excellent! Very well! You are the winner! From you, I sense the brilliant shine of skill that will overcome all! However, compared with me or even Wallace, you are lacking in elegance. Perhaps I should make you a loan of my outfit? <laughs> I merely jest. Rather than my clothes, I shall reward you with this, the Rain Badge. The Stone Badge heightens the attack power of your Pokémon. It also enables them to use the hidden machine move cut outside of battle. Please, take this with you too. The Technical Machine, Technical Machine 39, contains Rock Tomb. It not only inflicts damage by dropping rocks, it also lowers speed. If you use a Technical Machine, it instantly teaches the move to a Pokémon. Remember, a Technical Machine can be used only once, so think before you use it. The Knuckle Badge makes all Pokémon up to level 30, even those you get in trades. Obey without question. And, you'll be able to use the hidden machine move Flash outside of battle. If you'd like, use this Technical Machine too. That Technical Machine 8 contains Bulk Up. It's a move that raises both attack and defense stats. With this Dynamo Badge, Pokemon can use Rock Smash out of battle! And it will make your Pokemon a little bit faster too! Hmm, you should take this too! That technical machine there contains Shockwave! It's a trustworthy move that never misses! You can count on it! If you have a Heat Badge, all Pokemon up to level 50, even those you get in trades from other people, will obey you completely! And. It lets Pokémon use the HM move Strength outside of battle. This is a token of my appreciation. Don't be shy about taking it. That Technical Machine 50 contains Overheat. That move inflicts serious damage on the opponent, but it also sharply cuts the special attack of the Pokémon using it. It might not be suitable for longer battles. With that badge, the defense of all your Pokémon will increase! Pokémon that know the Hidden Machine move Surf will be able to travel over water. This is my gift to you, Brendan. Be sure you can use it correctly. Technical Machine 42 contains Facade. It doubles the power of moves if the Pokémon is poisoned, paralyzed, or burned. It might be able to turn a bad situation into an advantage. As a gym leader, I can't express how upset I am. But as a father, it makes me both happy and a little sad. It's sad. With the Feather Badge, all Pokémon up to level 70, even those received through trades will obey your every command. You will also be able to use the Hidden Machine move Fly outside of battle. And this? This is a gift from me. Technical Machine 40 contains Aerial Ace. It's speed. No Pokémon should be able to avoid it. Though I fell to you, I will remain devoted to bird Pokémon. The Mind Badge enhances the special attack and special defense of your Pokémon. It also lets you use Hidden Machine Move Dive outside of battle! You should also take this! That Technical Machine 04 contains Calm Mind! It raises special attack and it raises special defense! It's a move that's perfect for Psychic Pokémon! Having the Rain Badge shall assure you the full obedience of all of your Pokémon to your every command! The Rain Badge also allows the use of the Hidden Machine Move Waterfall to scale walls of cascading water! And, so that you never forget the battle we shared, take this! The Technical Machine I handed you contains Water Pulse! In use, it will occasionally confuse the target with ultrasonic waves. Having the Rain Badge shall assure you the full obedience of all your Pokémon to your every command. The Rain Badge also allows the use of the hidden machine move, Waterfall, to scale walls of cascading water. And, so that you never forget the battle we shared, take this. The technical machine I handed you contains Water Pulse. In use, it will occasionally confuse the target with ultrasonic waves. The trainers who have gathered all the gym badges of Hoenn should make way to the ultimate destination, the Pokémon League. Travel to the easternmost reaches of Hoenn, to the island of Evergrande. There, you shall find the Pokémon League.